Have you heard of Cagri Sema? What about Pemvidatide? No? Well, don't worry, because pretty soon, these names might be just as popular as Ozempic and Manjaro. Welcome to the next frontier in weight loss and metabolic health, where Big Pharma isn't just releasing more GLP-1 drugs, they're re-engineering them. We're talking about next-generation combination therapies that promise faster results, better control over appetite, improved fat burning, and even liver and heart protection. In this video, we'll dive deep into what Cagrisema and Pemvidatide are, how they work, and why these new drugs may leave even the best current treatments in the dust. Stick around, because this might just be the biggest shift in obesity and diabetes treatment since the GLP-1 revolution began. The GLP-1 Explosion Unless you've been living under a rock, you've probably heard of drugs like Azempic, Wegovy and Manjaro. They've taken the world by storm, offering people a pharmaceutical way to lose weight. And we're not just talking a few pounds. GLP-1s, short for glucagon-like peptide 1 receptor agonists, were originally created for people with type 2 diabetes. But as people started shedding weight, significant weight, they quickly found themselves in the spotlight for obesity treatment. These drugs mimic the natural hormone GLP-1, which helps regulate blood sugar, slow down digestion, and most importantly, signal to the brain that you're full. The result? Smaller meals, reduced cravings, and, for many, life-changing weight loss. But here's the catch. Not everyone responds the same way. Some people lose 20% of their body weight, others only 5%. Some see their blood sugar normalise, while others need higher doses or different drug combos. And that's where the next generation comes in. Limitations of current GLP-1 drugs. Let's be clear, Ozempic and Mounduro are powerful, but even they have limits. Weight loss plateaus, nausea, vomiting and GI issues. Slow onset of action, expensive and in short supply. And for many people, these drugs only target one or two pathways in the body. The next step, combination therapies that hit multiple receptors, amplify results and maybe even do it with fewer side effects. That's where Cagrisema and Pemvidutide come in. They're not just new, they're smart. Cagrisema, the duo that's turning heads. Let's start with Cagrisema, a drug currently being developed by Novo Nordisk, the same company behind Ozempic and Wegovy. So what is Cagrisema? It's a combination therapy of two active ingredients, semaglutide, which you already know from Ozempic and Wegovy, Cagrilintide, a lesser known compound that mimics another hormone called amylin. Cagrilintide works in a similar way to GLP ones. It helps slow gastric emptying, suppress appetite, reduce calorie intake, promote satiety. Together, semaglutide and cagrilintide create a synergistic effect, more powerful than either on their own. Clinical trials say, whoa. In one trial, participants using cagrisema lost an average of 15.6% of their body weight over 32 weeks. And that was just a phase two trial. Another trial showed that Cagrisema lowered A1C levels significantly more than semaglutide alone. It also had stronger effects on reducing liver fat, which is a huge bonus for people with conditions like MASH, metabolic dysfunction-associated steatohepatitis. And because it's still semaglutide-based, it retains the benefits we already know – cardiovascular protection, blood sugar control, reduced inflammation. Bonus, Novo Nordisk is also testing this combo for liver disease, heart failure, and even Alzheimer's risk. Cagrisimar's superpower, it acts on two hormone pathways, GLP-1, semaglutide, amylin, cagrilintide. That means it targets appetite, glucose, digestion, gut-brain signaling, and satiety from multiple angles. Pemvidutide, the dual agonist with a secret weapon. Next up, Pemvidutide, a name you're going to start hearing a lot more often. 
Developed by Altimune, Pemvidutide is being called a dual agonist, but with a twist. It targets GLP-1 receptors like semaglutide and terzepatide, glucagon receptors, which no other major GLP-1 drug currently targets. Now here's where it gets wild. Glucagon receptor activation equals fat burning. Unlike GLP-1, which mostly works by suppressing appetite and slowing digestion, glucagon has a thermogenic effect. It increases your body's energy expenditure, aka burns more fat. So while semaglutide tells you to eat less, pemvidutide tells your body to burn more. Clinical trials are very promising. In recent Phase 2 data, patients on pemvidutide lost up to 15.6% of their body weight in just 48 weeks, without the use of diet or exercise programs. And it gets better. Pemvidutide also significantly reduced liver fat by over 75% in many patients. That makes it one of the most promising candidates for treating NASH or non-alcoholic steatohepatitis. This is a major win because currently there are zero FDA-approved treatments for NASH. And guess what? Over 25% of adults in the US are estimated to have it. Dosage and delivery. Unlike some GLP-1s that require a daily shot, pemvidutide is being developed as a once-weekly injection, just like a Zempic or Manjaro. Also worth noting, early data suggests lower rates of nausea and GI side effects compared to semaglutide. Why Big Pharma is going all in? You might be wondering, why now? Because GLP-1 drugs are the future of treating not just obesity and diabetes, but liver disease, heart failure, kidney disease, even cognitive decline. The global GLP-1 market is projected to hit $100 billion by 2030 Novo Nordisk. And Eli Lilly are racing to dominate new players, like Ultimune are betting it all on their next-gen drugs. This isn't just a pharmaceutical trend, it's a global arms race, and patients might be the biggest winners. And all of this started with GLP-1. Cagrisema and pemvidutide aren't just the next Ozempic. They represent a new generation of smarter, faster, more powerful metabolic treatments. Whether it's by combining GLP-1 with amylin or GLP-1 with glucagon, these next-gen drugs promise to help people lose more weight, improve liver, heart and metabolic health, potentially lower side effects and address multiple diseases at once. If you're excited by the future of medicine, this is just the beginning. Don't forget to like, subscribe and hit that bell so you don't miss our deep dives into the newest breakthroughs in health, science and wellness.